Good evening. Hello. Good evening, teacher. Hello, hello. How are you? Good evening, everybody. Welcome. Good evening. Nice. Good evening. Happy faces, everybody. <laughs> Welcome to a new week of classes. Tonight we have our class number 11, I think. Yes. <laughs> Claps, 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 happy faces and all those reactions. Nice. Let me change something. Yes, my earphones are kind of different tonight. Yes, much better. Okay, how are you everybody? Welcome. Oh, nice. Happy faces. Good reactions. Happy reactions. Okay celebrations how was your weekend what did you do did you go good to the beach <laughs> did you go to the good park? evening teacher. hey good evening cecilia de hernandez miss hernandez yes <laughs> okay how long have you been married yes how long <laughs> how many years um we we have um, 80 year, eight, eight years, eight years, <laughs> eight years eight of years. marriage. Yes. Wow. But you look very young. Ah, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have children? No. Not yet. No. Nice. Well, I've been about 10 years and I don't have children either. <laughs> ah, okay. Uh -huh. Miss Tatiana, <laughs> good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? <laughs> good. Fine. Thank Hi. you. <laughs> nice. Where are you from? Acajutla. Acajutla. That's a beautiful port. Nice. Marilyn. Marilyn Marcela, welcome. Oh, she bought new earphones, you see? Nice. <laughs> Hello, good evening. Good evening. Ready for the class tonight? Yes. yes, that's great. That's awesome. That deserves a reaction of a celebration. Yeah. Tonight is March 14th already, right? the 14th of march yes great well welcome welcome let me show you my presentation i have it right here somewhere wait a second i think i click on the incorrect slide give me one second please oh yes here we go it's because i have two presentations <laughs> wait a minute okay here we go yes this is beginners three right beginners three is that correct oh yes it is well let's continue uh-huh volunteers two activities that you did on the weekend i stayed home on saturday and i went to los planes yesterday i worked on saturday i completed some assignments some activities i had and then yesterday i went to eat typical food and that was good that was delicious <laughs> okay somebody else volunteers to say what you did on the weekend oh we say names probably uh-huh miss kenya good evening what did you do on the weekend good evening good evening um, I studied. i studied oh I nice studied. are you I studying some oh are you studying at the university 
Yes. What career? Eh, segunda carrera, no sé cómo sería. The second major. Second major, eh, ciencia jurídica. In laws. Oh my God. Okay. Laws. Yes. Interesting. You want to become a lawyer? Yes. Yes. And the first yes. career? And is accountant accounting oh nice congratulations yes. did you yes. did you have an exam today or you will have the exam tomorrow uh, today and how was the exam um. <laughs> <laughs> it was a little bit difficult <laughs> yes okay <laughs> yeah you're gonna do fine don't worry yes. yeah i know i, I know a lot i of hope people. so yeah, I know a lot of people do very well in laws. If you like it, then you do well, well, well. Uh huh. Yes. Nominate somebody, Miss Kenya, to participate. Acabo de ingresar, no sé quién es participado. No, nadie ha participado, don't worry. Nadie. Cecilia de Hernández. <laughs> Your best friend. <laughs> no. <laughs> she nominated you. <laughs> Tell us about your weekend. Thank you, friend. <laughs> You're welcome. Anytime. <laughs> um, on, on, son, on Sunday, I went to the Bicentenary Park. Ah, you did exercise. Yes. Little, little. <laughs> I walked. <laughs> okay, nice. Yes. That's good. Say a name. Nominate another person. Um, Jami Rajo. Miss Jami. Miss Jami. <laughs> um, well, uh, good evening. Good Everybody, evening. Uh, I went to, to the Planes uh, de Renderos. Really? Saturday. Ah, oh, Saturday. Because yes. I went yesterday. Yes, uh, to enjoy with my family. And we have a good time. Nice. You had a good time. That's awesome. Yes, that place is beautiful. There are a lot of people, <laughs> many tourists, many people enjoying with their family, with their friends eating snacks, eating pupusas, just looking at the view. It is beautiful. Yes, and now they are selling mangoes, like the flower mangoes, like the beach. I'm, I'm a crazy, you know, I'm a crazy person for mangoes, so I'm a mango lover. So I buy mangoes every day if possible. <laughs> All right, nominate somebody else, Miss Jamie. Uh, Ervita. Okay. Miss Ervita. Miss Ervita. Hi. Hi. Good evening. Mm -hmm. Um, the weekend clean the house and the rest of Sunday rest um, and visit my family. All right, you visited your family. Where? Where did you visit your family? In Santana. In Santana. Okay, nice. Yes. You cleaned the house, you rested, and then you visited your family. That's good. Well, actually, I cleaned the house too on Saturday, <laughs> and I did the laundry at night because the water, you know, there's never there's water during the day. So I have to do the laundry about midnight. <laughs> <laughs> I hate it. <laughs> it's terrible. <laughs> okay, Miss Ervita, who's next? Um, Maritza Aguirre. Maritza Aguirre. Hello. Hey. <laughs> What did you do on the weekend, Miss? Oh, your microphone. Probably you are talking and your microphone is off. Yes. Good evening, I'm sorry. Good evening, it's okay. <laughs> uh, on weekend, uh, on Saturday, uh, was very, very tired. Oh my God. I 
I watch <laughs> um, in the morning. <laughs> um, you worked. Uh, I watch my clothes. Mm -hmm. You did the laundry. And go to my family in the afternoon. You visited your family. Uh, your Saturday, family. Mm -hmm. yes. Uh, on Sunday, I went to the church nice. in the morning. Yes. Um, for uh, in the afternoon, um, visit my family. Ah, you love your family. <laughs> <laughs> see my, <laughs> I see my mom. <laughs> Yes, that's nice. I saw yes. my brother today because he came to, to the Bloom Hospital with my nephew. So I saw him at noon for the lunchtime and I gave him a ride. So it was very fast, but it's not always nice seeing your family. Yes. Great. I, I do uh, play my, my niece. How you play with your niece? <laughs> yes. Um, ¿Cómo se dice? Uh, me entretengo bailándola. <laughs> I entertain myself I entertain. <laughs> when I come her here. Oh, mi Miss Nikki yes. has a, a baby boy. <laughs> nice. Thank Holy. you. Thank you so much. Maybe Miss Nidia wants to participate. Tell us about your weekend. Hi, good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening. Um, in Saturday, uh, I clean my house mm -hmm. and I watch the laundry. Um, también el, el Saturday, el Sunday, um, Hola, Nina. visit the uh, church. Oh, you went to the and church? Oh, my son. Nice. My, my son, my little son. <laughs> How old is he? I, uh, it is uh, 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 seven. He is seven. He is seven years uh -huh. old. He's um, seven years nice. old. Uh -huh. Nice. Um, nice to my... meet you. Well, nice to meet you too. Dear. Mm -hmm. Nice to meet you too. Dear. Mm -hmm. Nice to meet you too. Mm -hmm. That's it. <laughs> He's shy. <laughs> my older son. My older son, yes. Uh, yes. He's a uh, uh, 12. 12 years old. Nice. Uh -huh. Awesome. Well, thank you for participating. Maybe the rest will yes. participate. Yes, later, no problem. Thank you so much. Well, as I was saying, yes, we are in our class number 11, which is really great to have you all here. I hope you have had a wonderful weekend. Yes, of course. Well, in today's class, definitely we continue narrating about past events using irregular verbs. We're going to focus on using the irregular verbs. Remember the list to keep practice, 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 practice every day, okay? So we're going to use affirmative and negative sentence and ask yes, no questions and WH questions in simple past, okay? So here we have an exercise. Here we have the verb, it's an irregular yeah. verb in past, right? So we, of course, here is in base form. You need to put it in past, okay? So I'm going to give you some minutes. Para que lo traten de completar, of course, I'm going to share the picture. And you're going to compare your answers with your partner, okay? So lo van a tratar de completar. Si quieren, solo escriban los verbs in past de los que ven acá en las oraciones, luego lo vamos a comparar con todos, ¿ok? So, let me see. We're gonna... Yes, we're gonna make the groups for comparing, ¿ok? Let's create some... I'm gonna create... Well, not many groups. I'm gonna create seven groups, ¿ok? Yes, three or four people in each of the rooms and you compare your answers, right? Okay. Here we go.
Sí, por favor. Ok. Oh. Pues yo diría que estamos en la prehistoria. <risa> 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 No tengo nada que hacer, me saca, no sé qué. La fiebre, plátano. Ahí está, no sé si la logran ver. Sí, es. ¿Se logra ver? Sí. Sí, es. Vamos a comenzar. Green es el verbo, ¿verdad? Que vamos a pasar en su pasado. Bring. Bring, ¿verdad? Bring, será bring. Bueno, bring. Bring. Bring, vamos a decir. Ay, cielos. Ay, qué mala suerte, chicos. Llegan. Alguien quiere hacer el segundo. Here, verbo, aquí. Sí, es, es, es oír. Oír. Ah, no es aquí. Creo que ese es, es here, solo la D, ¿verdad? Eh, sí, no me acuerdo cuál es el. Here, Brow, 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 entonces sería brow, Daisy brow, sería Daisy brow, some chocolates do the birthday party, ¿verdad? Sí, la segunda. Ese sí está muy fácil, ¿verdad? Porque solo sería de agregar D. ¿O cómo here, sería ahí? Here, ¿verdad? Here. Ajá. Uh -huh. Here. Heart. No sé cómo se pronuncia. Ajá. Uh -huh. Heart. A ver. Creo que es heart. Uh -huh. Heart. Sí, es correcto. Um, I hear a new song on the radio. Uh -huh. Pero para decir, yo escuché una nueva canción en la radio, en el verbo hear en el, en el pasado. Sería sí. uh, hear. Hear con D. Oja. O solo agregamos a la hear. D. La D. Uh -huh. Pero lleva, sí. ¿verdad que lleva la E al final? No, no, sí. no, porque como es, es un irregular, entonces ajá, es, se cambia, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. eh, la regla, entonces. O sea, Vamos a ver. Bueno, pero de la primera, digamos que ya la tenemos. ¿pa? Que sería. Eh, bro. Esta es la de Bro. Ajá, Bro. 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 Hay que ir copiando aquí en el cuaderno para cuando la ticha no se dice. Ya que estamos nosotros. Vaya, ahora vamos con la segunda. I heard. En Peter. Eh, bueno, en la, en la I hearing a new song on the radio. Read sería Peter 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 reads three books last year. Yo creo que solo era mujeres. Read. Read, vamos a ver. Sí, ajá, tres libros. Peter. Reads. Speak. Eh, cuatro series. Ok. No me acuerdo de un verbo yo. El, el pasado de, de, de speaks es spoke. Um, understand. 
pero fíjese que uh -huh. understand sería este understood el pasado uh -huh. understood ya Peter understood during the class but now he doesn't understand understand yes. understand la, la yes. verbo pero el pasado es understood no sé si así se pronuncia pero si se lee understood understood understood, understood. 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 hasta ahí t o o t understood La sexta sería my mother forget forget it. Sería forget it. El pasado. Olvídalo. Vea que sí. Forget it. Okay. Okay, At asked. the age of 23, she became a uh, teacher ahí la o cambia por a became became a teacher uh -huh. I knew ahí la o cambia por e I knew the answer yesterday la siguiente es Peter told told me that he lived in New York ahí la e cambia por o y la última L cambia por D, creo. Déjenme checar. Tell. To. Vamos a ver dónde está. Estamos en la... Ajá, sí, top. Top. Eh, ¿Cuál estamos, perdón? Estamos en estamos la 13. En la... Uh, en la 14. 13, 13 Tark, porque... Tark. ¿Perdón? En la 13 sería la ED. Ajá, told. Ahí la E cambia por O y la D, perdón, la última L cambia por D. Told me. Sería... Si quieres dame eso, si te doy eso. Sería Swan. La nueve sería Swan. Sí. Y encontraron la con D. No, L O S T. Lost. Ah. No sé si se pronuncia. Lost. Lost. Sí. Pero el pasado. Luz, los perdió, perdió. Mandó otras, otras más. Ah, en serio. Sí. Mm, sí. Pero en esa tengo duda. Perdió. ¿Cómo sería el pasado? Lost. Lost, yes, lost uh, is correct. Uh -huh. Es un verbo irregular. Yes, in present is lose. L-O-O-S-E. Lose. Yes, that's in present. In past is lost. L-O-S-E. Uh, ok. Thank you. All right. Ajá. Squam. Swan. 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 Mm -hmm. Yes. 
dice le di un, un CD a mi madre para su cumpleaños entonces el verbo give en pasado sería gay what is the Quiero ver. Eso no nos había visto. Give es Gabe. Como de. Gabe, ajá, de como, como Gabe. Como Gabe, ¿verdad? Pero. Yo digo que entonces, verificamos. Ajá, va, entonces sería browser en el primero, giro en el segundo. Usted dice que es Iriba. O en la eh, tercera. Read. Read. ¿Y en, ¿Cuál fue la que me dijo que tenía ING? Mm, no, en, en la segunda hay earrings. Ah, okay. Pero usted me dijo de que no, que la dejáramos solo así como. No, no, no. Ajá, no, yo le digo porque el ING es como eh, understand understand eh, entiendo entendió ajá, en este caso sería entendió eh, ¿por qué? olvidar ¿Sí? olvidar en este caso sería el tiempo pasado, olvidó. Olvidó que se venga, se le ahí, half, es tener. Y la última, lo, lo, no sé cómo se produce. Perder. Los, los. Los, ajá, entonces ahí el los sería perdido. Me dieron la operación. Love, ok, las pilas. Las pilas. Nosotros olvidamos la chave. Okay. Hi, did you finish? Ya casi. Almost. <laughs> Almost, almost. Okay, good. Let's see. Wait a second. All right, here we are. Let's compare our answers. All right. This was the first, the first uh, group of sentences that you have to complete. So we're going to do it together. Don't worry too much about it. So in the first one, Daisy, the pass of bring. Bro. Mm -hmm. Bro. E Bro. R. O. O. A U U U G G G H T H T H T O Exactly. Daisy brought some chocolates to the birthday party. I heard A H T H T U A R R RD, <laughs> RD, I heard. I heard a new song on the radio. Peter. Red. 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 Se letrea igual, R, E, A, D, pero como está en pasado, se lee como el color red. Yes? Y digo, Peter read three books last week. The Smith. Spoke. 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 Es. The Smith spoke Italian to the waitress. Peter 
understood. 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 Lo único que cambia es el final de la palabra. Understand, uh -huh. understood. Yes. Peter understood during the class, but now he doesn't understand. <laughs> okay, poor Peter. My mother. It's difficult. <laughs> I know. <laughs> for what? For God. Forget for God. Only God. change the letter E God. for the letter O, right? For God. So my mom forgot to buy okay. some milk. Susan? Uh, 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 Susan uh, had a baby in August. H-A-D. Uh, yes. three, three letters. H-A-D. Right. Had. We... We lost the, our keys last Friday. Yes? Okay, great. We have to erase porque vamos a pasar a la siguiente and then we have to have this clear. Pues espero que lo hayan copiado so you got it. Correct. All right. So they Swim. Swim. Swam. 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 Spell swam. swam is W W A A M M. M. Swam. Swim. Swam. So just change the I yeah. for A, right? So they swam 500 meters yesterday afternoon. I gave gave G. A A A V B e. E. e E Right. I gave my mother a CD for her birthday. At the age of 23, Gabby. She became 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 become, became. So the letter O changes for the letter A, right? At the age of 3, she became a teacher. I become Knew. Mm -hmm. I knew. So instead of O, we put the letter E. So say, I knew the answer yesterday. Peter? Told. Told. So the, instead of E L L, we have T O L D, right? Peter told me that he lived in New York. We? Lent. Lent. L-E-N-T. Lend in present, lent in past, with the letter T instead of the letter D, right? So we we'll lent John 200 yeah. euros. She drunk. Drank. Drunk. Drunk. Drank too much coffee yesterday. Yes. Drink, drank. Only change drunk. the letter I for the letter A. Drunk. drunk, we drank too much. Oh, she drank too much coffee yesterday. <clears throat> right, good. So we erase again in order to have this clear. All right. Any question? No questions? No? So these sentences the were affirmative, right? If we have negative sentence, then we will have the auxiliary didn't. All right. Conversation, did you like it? That is the question, okay? So did you go anywhere last summer? Yes, I did. My sister and I went to Arizona. We saw the Grand Canyon, really? Did you like it? Oh yes, we loved it. Did you go hiking there? No, we didn't. Actually, we rode horses oh, yes. and we also went white water rafting. Yes. That's interesting, on the Colorado River, right? Wow, did you have fun? Yes, we did, we had a great time. All right, one more time. Let me see the spotlight here. So, so es como una expresión así como para romper el hielo y empezar a hablar, ¿verdad? <ríe> en este caso, so es una palabra comodín en inglés y puede significar so many things, actually. <ríe> so, did you go anywhere? Anywhere, algún lugar, right? Any place. 
Did you go anywhere last summer? Yes, I did. My sister and I went to Arizona. We saw the Grand Canyon. Really? Did you like it? Oh, yes, we loved it. Did you go hiking there? No, we didn't. Actually, we rode horses. But we also went white water rafting on the Colorado River. Wow, did you have fun? Yes, we did. We had a great time. All right, let's see. We're going to listen to Miss Marta and Miss Jami. Miss Marta is Laura and Miss Jami is Erica. Of course, here you can practice without these names because you have your real names. Okay, ready? Yes. Okay. Yes. One, two, three, go. So, did you? Did you go anywhere last summer? Yes, I did. My sister and I uh, went to Arizona. We saw the, the Grand Canyon. Really? Did you like it? Oh, yes, we loved it. Did you go hiking there? No, we didn't. Actually, from horses, uh, we also went the what water rafting on the Colorado River. Wow! Did you have fun? Yes, we did. We had a great time. We had a great time. Okay. Someone else? Great Another time. volunteer? Democracy, yes, Miss Ceci and Miss Jacqueline. Okay, Miss Ceci start and Miss Jacqueline continues. Ready? One, two, three, go. So, did you go anywhere last summer? Yes, I did. My sister and I went to Arizona. We saw the Grand Canyon. Really? Did you like it? Oh, yes, we love it. Did you go hiking there? No, we didn't. Actually, we rode horses and we also went white water rafting on the Colorado River. Wow, did you have fun? Yes, we did. We had a great day. We had a great Thank time. You. Thank you. All right. Great Miss, time. Yeah, we had a great time. We had a wonderful, fun time. Okay. Let's see. Miss Nidia is raising her hand. I don't know who else wants to participate with her. Someone else? Raise your hand. Uh huh. Hi, teacher. All right. Go ahead. So, Miss Nidia, you start. Okay, um, so did you go anywhere last summer? Yes, I did. My sister and I went to Arizona. We saw the Grand Canyon. Really? Did you like it? Oh, yes, we loved it. Did you go hiking there? No, we didn't. Actually, we rode horses, and we also went white water rafting on the Colorado River. Wow, did you have fun? Yes, we did. We had a great time. Wonderful, nice, very good. Okay, um, teacher, yes, um, tell me. What significa hiking? Hiking es como ir de caminata. Por ejemplo, si usted dice, ah, we went hiking to el Cerro Verde. En realidad solo fueron a caminar. Pero, o sea, acostumbra decir, we, we go hiking, we went hiking en este caso, porque es en pasado. Así, en extensiones grandes, ya con el propósito de ir de caminata. Generalmente la gente lo hace en montañas, en cerros, en parques ecológicos, así súper grandes. People go hiking here in Montecristo, 
en el tricinio, también ya eso ya sí es más extremo y es climbing, ya es escalar. Pero solo en la caminata, hiking. Ajá. Somebody else raise her hand, Miss Yami. Sí, en este caso, white, white water es un lugar. No, white water rafting es esta actividad, el hecho de ir en los rápidos, en estas balsas. Porque generalmente se hacen en aguas bien rápidas, en los ríos que tienen así ese caudal súper grande y que van bien rápido. Entonces, es, es realmente un deporte extremo. White water rafting. Así se llama, es como una balsa en, el, en los rápidos. Thank you, teacher. No problem. Por eso lo, creo que trataron como de hacer el, el picture acá, ¿verdad? De <ríe> white water rafting. Aquí en El Salvador dicen que se puede en una en un área en, en la EMPA, pero I never seen it. De hecho, aquí los poor rivers hasta se secaron ya. Y los otros los contaminamos y los matamos. Terrible, terrible. <risa> Citizens of El Salvador. <risa> poor rivers. No, no sé si a ustedes les ha pasado que pasan en un área donde tiene como los, no sé, como los rastros de que hubo una quebrada o un arroyo o algo así, se quedan como que... What happened here? O sea, sí, aquí, hay, aquí en Sonsonate ahí pasa que hay una quebrada aquí que solo quebrada está, pero no tiene agua. Exactly. <risa> y todos esos eran rivers. O sea, yes, o sea uh, la responsabilidad de nosotros como seres humanos debió haber sido a través de la historia preservarlos. No, es que, ¿qué es ese? Ah, qué triste, ¿verdad? Y ahí lo dejamos. Pero después viene toda la contamination y toda la deforestation y todo lo que tenemos y nos quejamos. It's terrible, definitely. Yes. Y a veces eran rivers, super big rivers. Y aún así ahora está así como un uh, caudalito. So water rafting de verdad tiene que ser mucha, mucha agua. Tiene que ser un gran caudal para hacer water rafting. Any other question? Anywhere? Anywhere es algún lugar. Any place, right? Anyone, any person, right? Anywhere is any place. Uh, but busquen los controles donde dice annotate acá y van a seleccionar la opción de circle. Porque con esto se puede. Y van a encerrar los verbs in past que encuentran en la conversation. Vamos a ver quién lo logra hacer primero. Ah, ese de arriba está bien. Voy a hacer un example. Yeah. <laughs> Le gané. Ay, <laughs> loved. <laughs> okay, went. Love it. <laughs> uh huh. Rod went. Uh huh. So. Road. <laughs> Es que tiene que seleccionar de una vez el círculo. Si él selecciona este de hacerlo con el puntero es más difícil. So you gotta choose this one. Uh -huh. Yes. Ok. De hecho, también los auxiliaries. Did, did, did. También está en paz. Ok. Uh -huh. Se puede también, ¿verdad? Sí. Did. Uh -huh. Didn't. Exactly. Ok, perfecto. All right, todavía tenemos algunos minutos para practicar la conversation, of course. Vamos a practicar en los mismos grupos que estábamos. Don't worry, yo borro esto. Clear all drawings. Ahí está. <ríe> ok, so, let's practice the conversation. Traten de hacerlo lo más natural posible. Igual, si quieren cambiar otros names, por ejemplo... Uh, did you go anywhere last summer? Yes, I did. I went to Lempa River with my sister. I don't know. I went with my brother to El Trifinio. And I saw Honduras from there. No se puede ser creative. Primero practiquen la tal cual está ahí. Luego pueden poner otras cosas, right? So you can adapt the conversation. All right, let's have the groups to work. On.
No, we didn't. Actually, we rode horses and we saw, uh, we also went white water rafting on the Colorado River. Wow, did you have a farm? Yes, we did. We had a great time. Okay. Okay. Ahora la otra compañera. Okay. So did you go anywhere last summer? Yes, I did. My sister um, went to Arizona. We saw the Grand Canyon. Did you go there? No, we didn't. I started with Rose Horse. And we all went white water writing on the Colorado right. Wow, did you have fun? Yes, we did. We had a great time. Okay, thank you. Ahora las otras compañeras. Yo comienzo. Bye. So, did you go anyway last summer? Yes, I did. My sister and I went to Arizona inside the Great Canyon. Really? Did you like it? Oh, yes, we love it. Did you go hiking there? No, we did. Actually, we rode horses and we also went water rafting on the Colorado River. Wow, did you have fun? Yes, we did. We have a great time. Ahora cambiamos. Inicio yo. Um, Hola. Me toca. ¿Quién me pregunta? Uh -huh. um, Menzi. Ok, uh -huh. inicio entonces. So, did you go anywhere last summer? Yes, I did. My sister and I went to Arizona. We saw the Grand Canyon. Really? Did you like it? Oh, yes. We loved it. Did you go hiking there? No, we didn't. Actually, we rode a horse and we all went white wider rafting on the Colorado River. Wow, did you have fun? Yes, we did. We had a great time. Bravo. Yes, so <laughs> <Gracias. can> yes. Como <laughs> no sé. Fue a la playa. Oh, o, fue, o no, precisamente fue con su hermana. No sé. Ah, ahí vamos a decir. Yes, I did. Uh, my brother and my mother. I went, I went to hiking de eh, imposible, el bosque lo imposible. We saw, we saw the Guatemala. Visited? Visited Guatemala. Really? Did you like it? Oh, yes. We 
¿Cómo sería? We, para decir nos divertimos mucho. Mm. We had fun. We have fun. We okay. have fun there. <laughs> <laughs> we, we have fun there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Luego va la otra pregunta. Uh, you like the place. Oh, yes. Uh, we... Creo que sería IT. El, pasa, el pasado de, de, walk, de caminar, walk. Walked. Walked. Uh -huh. We walked the, in the city and visited Sue, la Aurora. That's all. Did you have fun anywhere last summer? Yes, we did. My sister and I went to Arizona. We said the Grand Canyon. Really? Did you like it? Oh, yes. We love it. Did you go hiking there? No. I think uh, actually we rode horse. And we also went by water rafting on the Colorado River. Wow, did you have fun? Yes, we did. Uh, we had a great time. Cambiamos si quieren. Look. Bye. So, did you go anywhere last summer? Yes, I did. My sister and I went to Arizona. We saw the Grand Canyon. Really? Did you like it? Oh, yes, we love it. Did you go hiking there? No, we didn't actually. We rode horse and we also went white water rafting on the Colorado River. Wow, did you have fun? Yes, we did. We had a great time. Okay. Marta. Oh, ya no vamos. Did you finish? Yes. Did you practice? Yes, teacher. All right. Nice. All right. Let's do this last exercise and then we're done. No problem, okay? Did you have a good summer? Yes, I. How would you answer this? Yes, I did. Yes, I did, because it's a short answer, right? Yes, I did. Did you have a good summer? Yes, I did. I have. Hi. I have. I had a great summer. I just relaxed. I just relaxed. Relax. I just relaxed. Relax. Sounds like <laughs> I just relaxed. Uh huh. What is the question? Did you go? Did you go? Did you go? anywhere did you go yeah. right in question you have the auxiliary did so the verb goes the same did you go anywhere last summer no i did 
I didn't. I didn't, right? No, I didn't. I. I stayed. I stayed here. But my friends. Visited me. Yes. And on the weekends, we went. We went out. Out. Right? We went out a lot. Ya no me ocupo el out, but it's, we went out. Salíamos, o sea, salimos bastante. So, number three, what is the question? Did you? Did you? Did you? Uh -huh. Did you take any classes last summer, right? So, did you take any classes last summer? Mm -hmm. Yes, I did. I did. I talk. Yes, I did. Ahí yes, hacemos did. la pausa, ¿verdad? Yes, I did. I, I, I took, took, I took tennis lessons. How interesting. Me voy a mover esto para acá. And y esto I más arriba. Uh -huh. I took tennis lesson and I played. 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 I played. Uh -huh. Tennis every day. Okay. Next question. Did you speak? Right? Did you speak English last summer? No, no, I, did. no, no I, didn't. I didn't. I didn't. <laughs> no, I didn't. <laughs> True. I didn't. But I. I read. read. I read. The spelling is the same, but the pronunciation in past is like the color. Remember, I read English books and I, and I, watched, I watched English movies, right? Okay, so that would be. Okay, thank you. Thank you for attending the class today. It's 9 p.m. and I have another class. So I'm very happy to see you and I will see you tomorrow. Okay, you tomorrow. Bye. 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 Bye.